Hi everyone, Ken here. How are you? Today we're going to be making uh, stuffing for our Thanksgiving special. Um, I'm going to be making stuffing, then a turkey, then the gravy. So I'm going to do it in three parts. So let's go over the ingredients we're using today. I'm going to start off with using Pepperidge Farms uh, stuffing. Uh, this is a 12 ounce bag. You can also use stovetop stuffing, but you're going to need two boxes for the stovetop and you may have to add uh, more water or uh, broth. So just read the box if you're using a uh, stove top. I'm also going to be using uh, one pound of breakfast sausage. Today I'm using Bob Evans. I have two tablespoons of butter. We're going to be using two cups of chicken broth or stock, whatever you'd like. I have one large onion diced and I have three ribs of celery diced. So and the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go over the stove and we're going to put this uh, on the stove and along with the sausage. Okay, so first thing we're gonna do, this is gonna be uh, for the onions and celery. I have the heat on uh, medium low. I just don't wanna burn them. So uh, the idea of this, I want everything to turn translucent and softer. So drop those in. Approximately you take Roughly 10 minutes. Slow is the way to go for this. And then it's approximately be the same time as our sausage is done. And then we, so now on the sausage, I have the burner on medium or just a touch under medium. Go ahead and chop that up. And we're just gonna cook this till it's brown and not burn. So the sausage only took about six minutes to fully cook. So I'm going to turn the sausage off and I'm going to let uh, the onions and celery cook for another four minutes or so. Okay, the onions are done. We're going to turn off the heat. So the heat's off on both. Now we're going to take our sausage and add it right into the mix. Try to leave out as much of the grease on the bottom there as you can. And if you don't like the sausage, just totally skip this part. And it'll turn out just fine. Right. Okay, now we're going to take our two cups of chicken broth. And we're going to add it to the mixture here. Just to warm the liquid up. Do a little stir. Okay. Now we're going to go add this to our stuffing uh, mix. All right. Now we're going to take our stuffing mix into a large bowl. We're going to take our liquid contents. Pour everything in there. We'll mix it around. Now, don't use your hands because it's going to be super hot. Just give it a good stir. Now I'm going to be stuffing the turkey with this and you can make this the day before. So at this point, um, I'm going to put it into a casserole dish. Okay, I'm going to take our casserole dish, give it a little spray, just keep it from sticking. And put all of this in there. Now, if you wanted to, you could bake it right now. 
at 350 degrees for 35 minutes. You know, if you're going to use it now as uh, like this. But if you make it the night before and you put it in the fridge, cover it up. Um, it's going to be a little bit colder, so put it in the oven, 350 degrees still. Um, but it's going to take 40 minutes. But that's a beautiful looking stuffing here. But I'm going to be taking some of this for the bird. So if you want more uh, stuffing, just double uh, the batch we use here. Anyways, this is part one, the stuffing. Um, thank you all for watching and have a great day. Take care.